Good morning, everybody. Yeah, rock some bar. Okay, just had a little moment there for myself. Um, oh my god, guys, I am so excited because today I am going to Tokyo and I have never ever ever been to Tokyo and I am so excited and I'm so happy and it is raining and it's cold as fuck but I don't care because I'm so excited to go I am so excited I'm trying not to talk too loud right now because I have to keep in mind that there's people trying to sleep and it's the morning so it's very hard for me not to be screaming but yeah I'm very excited Moving on, um, I am sitting here in my hotel. Obviously, my makeup's ready to go. I'm, I've still got my robe on. Oh, my hand hurts. Oh. I have my robe on because I want to show you this robe before I go anywhere because I like, oh my God, it's so cute. Um, so yeah, I'm just in my hotel room. We're about to go to Tokyo, so we're gonna catch a train to go there, I think. Um, so currently in Narita um, and yeah we're going to catch a train and we're going to go to Tokyo and we're going to go to the Shibuya crossing because I've never been there and we also are going to go to Harajuku I think. Don't have that much time um, to do things. Oh my god is it snowing? Is that snow? I think it's snowing. Oh my god it's snowing. It's snowing! Oh my god. Sorry, I'm just very excited about this. <laughs> oh, this is the famous dog. What? We are in Shibuya, in the Shibuya crossing. Hello. Hello, YouTube. <laughs> we made it. What time is it? It's 10 to 11. 10 to 11. It's not really that busy. No. Oh, wow. It's weekend. How cool. Oh, my God. This feels so weird. It's like the whole... playing music. Where's, oh, the music from all the like different shops are coming through. Sounds like the whole street is just playing music. Should be a crossing just over there. Smell yummy food. Oh my god, this one. <laughs> Puppy! <gasps> it wants me, look! Oh, oh my god, I need Shibuya. Look at this cute Disney. Cool. Massive Zara over there. I love this street, it's like so clean and pretty. <laughs> Last shop. Oh my 
my god. Hello. Hello. This is. Oh. Oh my god, so cute. Look at this. <laughs> Masa, do you want to tell everyone where we are? We are in the large green have a jacket. Look at this. Like a sushi train. It's like a sushi train but of bath bombs. <laughs> but they've got like a sushi shaped bath bomb right here. Oh, a sushi shaped bath bomb. <laughs> that is amazing. <laughs> Hi! This is the Bap Bam Concept Shop and this is the only one Bap Bam store in the world. So we have 89 kinds of Bap Bams, but actually 59 of them are exclusive here. And where are we? In Kara, in Tokyo, Japan. Hello, we're about to go and find some food. In Takashira Street. Takashira Street. Here it is. Very busy. Harajuku. There's a lot of young people. Yeah. It makes me feel like I'm 20 now. <laughs> <laughs> happy, 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 happy. Super happy. Super happy. <laughs> Super fun. What are we going to eat? Well, we're going to eat. Well, we're going to have to try Japanese crepes. Yes, we're going to try Japanese crepes for yeah. sure. Yeah. And then uh, that, that'll be our appetizer. I don't know what <laughs> <the name. laughs> I'm having a burger. Oh, it looks so good. It looks so good. Oh. And it's a pasta. Masa? So hungry. Where are we? We are in Harajuku. What's, it? What's the name of this? I think it's one? called Bolf. I think Bolf can't. Oh, here we go. There we go. This is oh, okay. In what's the street called again? The Takashita Street. Takashita Street. It's right by the train station. Ready to eat. I'm so hungry. What do you think? It's good. I like that. Mmm. This burger is amazing. Crunch factor of the fry. Pretty damn crunchy. Yay! Pancake! <laughs> berry, berry, and what's I've your one? Banana strawberry chocolate. Cheers! Cheers! <laughs> Cheers. Oh, is oh my god, yeah. Is it good? Good. What is this place called? Sweet Box. Yeah, Sweet Box. <laughs> Sweet Box crepes in. In Harajuku, Takashira Street. Takashira Street. Oh. Yeah. Know, halfway down in the line in the street. Mm. Mm. So good. Super good. Happy times. I am pretty tired right now, to be honest. I feel like I was on an adrenaline rush the whole day because I was just so excited and so, so, so happy about going to Tokyo. It was like a really rash, sort of not rash, but just like a last minute decision that. Um, I didn't think I would get to go 
and then I had beautiful Masa with me. He's amazing. And um, he's from Tokyo, so that was amazing that he wanted to, he was willing to sort of show me around because I don't think I would have gone by myself. Like I feel quite intimidated about taking like the train and stuff in Japan on my own because I obviously don't understand the language. Um, so I was super, super, super lucky to have him. Yeah, I feel like today was probably one of the happiest days I've had in a long time. And I just wanted to leave sort of in this, in this vlog by saying or talking about how sometimes when you are on social media and you look into someone else's life through a vlog or Instagram photo or Snapchat or whatever, it looks like their whole life is this perfect bubble of happiness and that is not the case and I feel very 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 grateful that I get to travel these amazing places um, and I feel very blessed and I was extremely happy today um, but not every day is a super super happy day and I think my sort of main message that I want to leave you guys with is to keep in mind that we are all human beings and that we all go through anxious, sad, jealous, greedy, shitty moments um, and that's okay and uh, yeah if you look into someone's life, if you look at someone's vlog you only see a very small part of their life and so please don't sit on the other end of the screen and I've done this as well and think oh my god like she must be so happy 24 7 or whatever or you know don't look on people's Instagram and think that their life is just always this like rainbow sunshine pretty photos perfect hair perfect makeup type of thing or you know like personally I look at people on Instagram and I'm like oh my god whatever if, say if it's a model I'll look at their life and think oh my god like she's so beautiful she must never wake up and feel ugly and <laughs> that sounds so stupid but it's true that's how I think sometimes and I get caught up in it and then I kind of realize that everyone has moments where they feel down and that's what makes us human and yeah just remember that the only way to really live a rich life is to be able to enjoy the good moments and the bad moments. So what I mean by that is when when you have moments of sadness, fear, anxiety and all of that shitty stuff and you really push it away and lock it down, you're not doing yourself a service. Um, and when you can accept that life is a string of moment of string of moment moments string of moments and some of those moments will be super happy and some of those moments might be super sad and accepting both is what gets you to a really rich way of living your life um and it's something that i have done myself as you guys know i have done a video on meditation something that i do every single day um, lately I've been trying to do it for longer um, and I don't it doesn't mean that I feel less sad it means that when I feel sad I don't push it away as much or when I feel anxiety I don't push it away and so kind of being mindful with it changes your relationship with um, all of those negative emotions and that's what creates beauty in life and so I just live my life in a different way now and yeah I encourage you guys to you know think about that um, and just remember that not every day is going to be happy and that you can find really mindful happy moments in the smallest things you don't have to travel all the way to Japan to feel different because the reality is how you feel on the inside reflects what you see on the outside so you could be a you know you could be in the most beautiful place on earth like japan or 
you know Tokyo or New York or whatever and if you feel like shit you're not going to enjoy your time in this place or if you're constantly battling with your mind you're not going to have a good time so just think about that and I want to leave you with that message today me and my fried chicken are gonna go I really hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog I had a really good day and I feel super super grateful right now my heart feels very full of love like love just love for everyone and so I'm a happy girl and yeah I love you guys I hope that Sorry I'm whispering, it's because I'm in a hotel and I'm just being super mindful that there's people trying to sleep next to me. But yeah, I hope that you guys have a beautiful day. Bye! Don't forget...